Okay, let me quickly talk about injector injection pump timing advance. You can see there is a mark here. This mark on this is injection pump of a four cylinder engine. This is you can see there is a mark on the injection pump, and there is a mark on this case in two. You can see the mark. There is a mark here too. So this mark must correspond with this one when you are installing the injection pump but sometimes for quick starting you may need to do the timing advance well, what are you going to do in this type of engine for you to do the advance you need to bring the injector downwards you you slack this knot you can see there are slots here that give you room for you to bend the injector so you need to slack this knot and the down one, the one on, on that here is three. You slack this one, you slack this one, and the other under one here, you slack it. Then you are able to bend the injector to your side. Then by the time you bend, you notice that this mark is not correspond with this mark again because this one will go downward a bit. That means you have advanced the injection pump, and when you advance the injection pump, it helps for quick starting. That is what you have just done. However, you need to know that it must not be too much. If you allow it, the advance to be too much, it will come with um, knocking sound of to your engine. So you need to be careful. But if you want to retard it, that means you shift it upward. That means the injection will not the injection mark, the injection pump mark will not be up here. Why the uh, the mark on the um, the front cover will not be down one year? That is your retard. But to advance in this type of engine, you bring it to your side. But to retard, you take you take it away to your side. So that is why you have this mark here. This is slot. You can see it is give you room for you to shift the injection pump up or down. So for quick starting, you can advance your injection pump. But as I said, you need to be careful if you overdo it, it will be you will be having a knocking sound as if the engine is the engine will give you a knocking sound, which is not too good to your engine. And in most cases, it will also make your engine to become hot. Yes, the engine will overheat. So by the time you advance, you have to do it gently, at least a little bit. Then you take note if the engine is uh, too hot then you, you you reduce your advance but your doing your uh, injection pump advance will make the engine to start quick and that is usually happen when you notice that like this is a rotary type of injection pump if this rotary is becoming weaker then you have what you call hard um, starting then what you can now do is that you can increase the timing of the injection that means that detonation or uh, combustion take place before the manufacturer setting that is just the meaning so by the time you advance it helps the detonation to occur before the manufacturer setting so that is uh, injection pump advanced timing in this type of engine so in most engine it may be different but the principle is the same you must see the two mark on the injection pump here that on the on the casing here when the when everything is still normal this mark will be equal like this this one will be here why this one will be here but when the engine when the injection pump is becoming weaker or you have a starting then you can go for advancement so you need to know the direction of the engine before you can know where to advance the engine so like in this engine now if i want to advance now i push to my side but if i want to reduce the advancement then i push it away from my side to the other side to reduce the the, the injection the the timing of the advancement so that is how to advance